Hey everybody. So I created a very cool method for Chromebooks on how you can install Wipe Offline Remaster version 2 on it. Now, what this requires is you need to have Node.js installed a Chromebook. You can see I've done a couple of testing with this pretty cool unwink thing. Well, to tell C if Node.js is installed, you can just do npm minus v. You can see for me, Node.js is installed, so I've come up with that. But if Node.js is not installed in a Chromebook, it will come up with an error. Say every npm command does not exist. So, yeah, that's pretty much the story. So now on to reinstalling Wrapper. So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the link located right in the description and then you're gonna click on install wrapper.txt and then you're gonna copy this command. And then you're gonna go into terminal. And yeah, this only works if you have, if you have Linux installed. To do that, you just go to settings or your Chromebook. You just do Linux pretty much. You just search that, it'll come up with Linux development environment. You just turn it on and boom, it'll turn it on for you. It'll, it'll just actually select the storage of just ignore all the settings, you just turn it on, boom. And there you go, yeah, it resets to your terminal. Yeah, you have to enter any username you want. So yeah, basically what you're gonna do is, in a terminal, you're gonna paste the command, using CTLV, and then you're gonna click enter. And then it should receive the command and install the wrapper and then extract it. And there you go. Install the wrapper that quick. It took about a second. Now what you're gonna do is... <laughs> Sorry, this is all in beta right now. I nearly forgot. <sighs> Sorry, folks. I nearly forgot about this chaos. I'm gonna, I'm gonna update it. Yep. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I, I'm such an idiot. I, I did not even realize <laughs> that was gonna happen. So yeah, now, now that the update was start whatever. <laughs> But for now, we're just gonna do it manually. But for the future, though, yeah, for the future, what you're gonna do is to start wrapper. You are just gonna do start wrapper. Do text TST. You're gonna use that, and then you're gonna copy the command. You'll copy this command and paste it in, but it's not working right now, so I'll just do it using the method. Just let me do this, please. Don't, don't do what I'm doing. Just, you, just copy. Just copy this command. Folks, was causing for a fix. So, I'll be back with you shortly. Alright, folks, I'm back and I just got Wipe Offline and Master of Walking. You can probably tell by the start. Now, this is where you're going to need Adobe Flash. So, if you have SwimJet already installed in a Chromebook, you're, you're just gonna. You click on it, and then it should pop up. This from Jet Browser. <sighs> then just head on down to localhost four three four three, and it will pop up the video list. It should. Just gonna open up the logs. Oh. Oof. 
Oh my goodness, yeah, this thing works like as an error. You're gonna need to do better. So basically, yeah. <laughs> I honestly don't know why it didn't do that the first time, but uh, there is this logo. Uh, hold on, let me change the image. I don't know why. You're gonna, you're not to blame. It's just the stupid image. So just close that up. Yeah, you can make, you may notice that I modified my swim dryer a little bit. Yeah, you, you may notice that I modified it. You see how there's to be, yeah, I modified it. So I was taking a bit once again. Uh, there was a lot going on, and in this lap of today, there was a lot going on. Hold on, let's open up the logs again. Okay, nothing, nothing popped up, so yeah, it's good. Yeah, perfect. You can see Rob Ralph Line, we mastered that's popped up. Yep, now if we were to make a video. And, and ignore the thing, that's normal. You can see that Lab Offline is gonna load. And yeah, the logo's kind of weird too. Yeah, it's not designed to be like that. But the static works fine too, but yeah, not the logo. It looks like, yeah, it looks like it went through some hard times. Yeah, someday I might modify the logo. I don't know yet. But yeah, you can see, your Gunner's World 2.0 works, works very well. Yeah, there's some new templates, like... This, for example, if you're getting a house sucked into a black hole, you can use that. And... <laughs> that would be quite convenient, if you made a scene where a house gets sucked up a black hole. <laughs> if you are watching this, do you think I should make that random video? Comment below, please. <laughs> I think it would be really funny. If you ask me it's funny too, just comment below. <laughs> but yeah, you can see his weird stuff. Yeah, there's a gunner's block characters. There's... There's a cell, yeah, there's a gunner's cell, there's that weird guy. And here is... <clears throat> yeah, that weird type of guy. You got Kami World and you've got I don't know why visual effects is on here. I don't know why. Yeah, I honestly don't know why he would want to do that. So um, yeah, I'm just not gonna ask why he decided to include it. See, there's a snowstorm you can play by size it anywhere you want. I guess that's a good thing. Also, community library also works too. So, I'm assuming that's pretty good. Yeah, because back in the day, this thing used to not work, but now it does work thanks to your Gundam's World Animator for fixing the bug. And you've got Powerpuff Girls too. See how. <laughs> you got all these wonderful backgrounds, characters, but you got Buttercup, you've got <laughs> Alpha 24 makes videos out of Buttercup. <laughs> but for some reason, this thing did not come with starters, so I'm not going to show you the starters. But what I'm going to show you is pretty much the whole thing. So there you go, that's how you install Wrap off while we mastered our Chromebook. So make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications. Oh, and if you're working to install Adobe Flash Player on your Chromebook, if you're working to install it, I have a link to, I have a link to below. And also, I met emails I've been noticing that people have been trying 
to request uh, this Flash play I got do. Well, about that, I did make it public. And I know the reason why. So it's basically has something to do with a .NET organization. So if you .NET users out there watching, then I won't be able to share the Flash Player thing with you because your, your, your admin of that organization does not allow me to share the Flash Player with you. So I'm sorry. I know I would be nice about it, yeah, I know I made it public, but it's just weird that it doesn't want to show it for you, that thing is so long. But yeah, there you go, that's how you, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I just show this off to you, yeah, I do not need to, but um, yeah, all you do is download it, make sure where it's enabled, you double click the file, it'll ask you back about store, blah, 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 boom, it's restored, and blah. <clears throat> yeah, because I get tired of, like, trying to mention. <clears throat> yeah, I'm signing off now. <laughs>